So the last race from Goodwood, 0 to 100 handicap for three years and up. 12 furlongs. The distance, one is fired by Joshua Sutherland. Two, a born Infanta, James Shea. Three, the stable companion, Oz Demina, Candlelight. Four is Dolores Abernathy, Dan Hughes. Five, Arabian Night, Patrick Hogan. Six, do it again, Satyam. Seven, words as weapon, Leon von Rensburg. Eight is Pale Blossom, nine, Star Lord. Ten is Jane Burden, Martin Needham. Eleven is Kowalski. Paul Rhodes, 12, Barbacaos, Darren Thompson, 13, Deli and Star, Alex Sherry and Fortin, S. Calamitous, Jim Murray. That the start. And away they go. Slightly slow away was a Jim Murray's horse, um, but he's quickly recovered from that slow start. And it's uh, poking ahead in front is Words' weapon, but Born Infanta now goes to take it up. So Born Infanta from Kowalski for Paul Rhodes. Then comes uh, Kalimut Kamala to sit back in third. Uh, Barbara Rose, Barbara back behind that. Uh, uh, up on the inside is Words' weapons. Do it again. He's on that one's outside. Then comes Arabian Night and Dillian Star at the back of the field. So Born Infanta has got four lands to lead for over to Kowalski in second. Barbara, Barbara Coast sit back in third in Osdem and Candlelight. Pale Blossom out wide is a Martin Leedens, um, uh, Jane Burden. Then comes Star Lord, Dolores Abathy, and those blue colours for Dan Hughes. Uh, then uh, Joshua Sutherland's father with Do It Again, and that one's inside with the words as weapon. And at the back of the field, Delian Star and Arabian Night. There's only about 10 lengths from first to start, first to last, and Born Infanta takes him along. Three lengths clear of stable companion Oz Dominia Candlelight. Kavoska for Paul Rhodes back in third. On that one, the inside for Darren Thompson is uh, Barbacosa. Then comes the two stable companions travelling wide, Pale Blossom and Jane Burden. The field's starting to pack up now as a. Uh, uh, Trailing those is Star Lord with uh, Dolores Abernathy, then Do It Again. Out wide is Fiber with Delhi and Star, and then Arabian Night and Words as Weapon has dropped to the back of the field. So Born Infanta takes him along from his stable companion Osdemonia Candlelight. Jane Burden back in third for Martin Needham. Then Darren Thompson's Barbacos. Uh, Pale Blossom behind that with Kowalski, then Star Lord and Words as Weapons. The two yellow coloured horses do it again in Arabian Night, and Dolores Abernathy dropped to the back of the field with Fiber. So with four phones left to go, Born in fact is still the leader from Jane Burden back in second. Uh, Calamitous is looking dangerous in third. Uh, behind that is uh, Push Along Osimo's Candlelight. Trying to pick up now is Pale Blossom. Out wide is uh, Star Lord for Joshua Sullivan. And traveling very strongly up the outside is Delian Stars. Come from the back of the field. Nowhere to go for Bobacos. Up the inside is Words as Weapon. There's two phones left to go. Born in fact is still the leader from Jane Burden in second. Trying to get through now. Stable companion leader is Osdemonian Candlelight. In between, now finally in the clear is Barbacos. Barbacos has some traffic problems. Robbins is in the clear out wide is a star lord for Joshua Sullivan and so now it's all changed up front and Jane Burden picks it up at Barbacos overcame those traffic problems to get to the front Barbacos yes Jane Bird fighting back up the inside finishing strongly as Calamitous and Words as Weapon as Calamitous who gets up to pass the lead this from Words as Weapons as second back in third I think was star lord Yeah, Calamitous gets up to win that for Jim Murray. Words as weapon back in second for Leon Fernandez. Jane Burden looked to winner with a furlong to go, but faded to finish third. Barbacos had a lot of traffic problems and managed to finish fourth and might have cost at the race, actually. Um, back in fifth was uh, Pale Blossom, also for Martin Eden, and Star Lord faded out of it to finish in sixth for Joshua Sutherland.